All right. I got to talk about this. Let's move on to a different topic so I don't even get more furious here. Sunday at TLC, they announced today the first ever Firefly Inferno match. Now we're looking at turning everything around. What? Following the angle where Randy Orton lit Bray Wyatt on fire, WWE announced that Orton versus The Fiend will now be a Firefly Inferno match. (laughs) Okay. Let's think about this. So you did an angle where... Randy allegedly lit Bray Wyatt on fire, right? Yeah. Do you guys remember how that ended? The well, it ended when out. the fiend just showed up and he hadn't been lit on fire or lit or litten, whatever. And Man. he attacks Randy Orton. So they've already established that you can't burn this guy up. So what do we have an inferno match for? Am I thinking too hard about this? After the fiend's mind games. Cost Randy Orton an opportunity to once again... Oh, God, I almost had a heart attack. I thought that was actually from our website, but this is actually from WWE.com. After the Fiend's mind games cost Randy Orton an opportunity to once again compete for the WWE Championship, the Viper fired right back by taking hold of Alexa Bliss in an attempt to coax the Fiend during a tense installment of A Moment of Bliss. Is that what happened? (laughs) Great. (laughs) Who wrote that? Well, I'm glad they did because I didn't know what the point of that segment was, but now they've explained (laughs) it to me. So here's your TLC Sunday, everybody. Roman Reigns, Kevin Owens, TLC. Drew McIntyre, AJ Styles, TLC. Orton versus Fiend in a Firefly Inferno match. I guess you have to light the other bro on fire. Sasha versus Carmella. Shayna and Nia versus Asuka and whoever it's going to be because Lana's off the show. And The New Day versus The Hurt Business. Well, uh, three out of six, um, 50% maybe there. Roman Owens, Drew, AJ, New Day, Hurt Business. Okay, I'll put that on on the left side of the ledger right now. On the right side is the rest of it. Um, I guess there's been a lot of banter over who could be the partner that comes in and saves the day for Lana. Maybe Lana can come out riding Charlotte Flair's shoulders if she comes out to the ring, as a lot of people expect her to do or would like her to do at least. Here's the big money line. The Fiend has changed every man to step into the ring with him, but Orton has proven time and again to be a different breed of superstar. Can the legend killer walk through the fire, or will the Fiend burn Orton for his past transgressions? And by changing every man, it means get less over after being in the ring with with Bray Wyatt. Let's see if... uh... If Randy Orton can can stop that when he faces the fiend, this stuff sounds so stupid when I read it. I wonder if it's better when like you just hear it in stupid. your own brain. No, it's stupid. It's stupid. I'm sure this is playing to somebody, but there's <laughs> again the Bray. This whole storyline has been ridiculous, and I mean, let's give him this. I mean, here's the one time they actually have a little bit of continuity since the one constant when it comes to Bray Wyatt and Randy Orton has been something lit on fire going back to the the stupid house. If you love these video clips, head down there to the bottom right-hand side of the screen and click Join. For just $7.99 per month, you get full access to all of the episodes, over 300 at current count, Full-length episodes of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, and Figure Four Daily with both Lance Storm and Filthy Tom Lawler. You can also hit that subscribe button, and you'll always be alerted as to when new shows are available.